Hello, this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Terranigma! Let's continue on through Eclamata! Now, it's kind of hard to see here, but there are some rocks in the way, and we really want to move those out of the way there, specifically. We got these little slides here, but we can't climb up those, so you can only go down them. So we gotta find a way to get up there. Whoa! Wonder what all these... What are they? What's a Rakshasi? Or Rakshasa? Or whatever. Some kind of devil demon creature or something? I don't know. Oh crap, I'm confused. Basically, yeah, what confusion does is it's kind of like in Secret Armana where it, um, it reverses your directions, but not so directly. It mixes it up every few seconds, so it'll, like, change it 90 degrees or something like that or whatever, so it's a really annoying status ailment, and the only way to cure it, as far as I know, is to use a wind pin like I just did there, or to exit the screen. And since I was right in the middle of the place, not a whole lot I could do about that. Now, every now and then, if you get stuck, just, you know, try to reach for some rocks or something like that, and, well, that'll take care of your problems. Whoa! Let's see, we got two of these. Yeah, it'll be worth it. Let's use a power ring on these guys. What was I saying about confusion? Eh, whatever. But, yeah, yeah, that's really the only way of dealing with it. Take these guys out. There we go. Get some money! I'll be getting something to deal with those guys a little easier soon enough. Oh, yeah, now I remember what I was thinking. Someone was saying, use the slider move on them. That's much more effective on them. So, there you are. I want to save my grass pin because I think I'm close to getting a level. Well, there we go. Don't go down there yet. For some reason, those slides remind me of Crystallis. This game reminds me a lot of Crystallis. <laughs> Whoa! There we go. Yeah, if you ride down the slide, you can open up this secret passage. And we get a nice suit. I'll equip that in a moment. But, you know, I'm going to get something else to equip. We can also do that slide thing down here. So, uh, yeah, let's take care of that now, as long as I got all the enemies out of the way. Just take a moment. I really like this area. I mean, the whole winter theme and everything like that. I, mean, I always just love ice areas. I don't think I've ever seen a winter area that I didn't like. Oh, and that opened up a passage there. Sorry, I kind of went off screen there, but yeah. But yeah, I mean, who doesn't love ice areas? It's just nice, calm, and serene with confusing monsters. Okay, these monsters are a little annoying, but yeah. Eh, there we go. That's the chest I was looking for. And it contains the fire pipe. Yes, that's what I was looking for. So let's equip that. It is fire elemental. It's really effective against the wolves and those... What were those other guys? The crystal guys. So I think I should be able to one-shot them now. This one protects you against fire. It's a little more powerful. I don't recall how it's exactly more powerful against fire, but eh, whatever. Let's get out of here. So yeah, that's how you get those two things. That's really important that you have those. So now we're back up here. Whoa! Get those guys. I think, whoa! Almost dead here, but I can make it. Come on. There we go. Got the level. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a moment to... Uh, I'll take care of all these guys off-screen, if I can, and then I'll move on from here. Actually, you know what? I'll just meet you up on that upper platform there. How's that sound? Okay, we're back up here with all the enemies out of our way, so let's go through here. Hey, I want to go left! Stop! We can't stop. We have to slow down first. All right, that's enough of that. Well, let's show how uh, powerful this fire pike is. Okay, maybe that's not so powerful. Well, it's better against them. I should. I thought I was one shotting them off screen, but and these get, these slimes will split if you don't. Well, if you kill them. Hold on, watch this. You see, it splits up, kind of like those guys in uh, Final Fantasy three. Yeah, those splitting enemies—they weren't fun at all. But anyway, huh, it's a dead end. I, can't get through there. Well, let's talk to this flower. It's a snow grass, I guess. Oh, well, there we go. Huh, wasn't there a guy in a hot spring earlier? Maybe we should take this snow grass 
leap to him. Looks more like a flipper to me, but uh, we'll take it with us anyway. So I'm just going to backtrack through that cave off screen and meet you outside by the, uh, by the hot spring there. Okay, I finished all that backtracking there. I figured it was straightforward enough. I might as well have done it off screen. So let's give this Yeti, I think it's a Yeti, the snow grass leap in the hot spring there. Uh-oh, it's making him angry. Oh, well, no, no, it actually uh, helped him out. So, all right, there we go. We got a new friend here. Better than Mog. Hey, uh, sure, why not? Sounds like a good idea. Unga! That's about as good of a Umaro impression as you're gonna get out of me, viewers. Not really a fan of Umaro. Yeah, you see what that guy was doing? He, I don't know if you could read the text there, but he was trying to summon hell. If only there was a way I could get to that chest there. Let me remove a background layer there so you can see what I'm doing. You just go behind the trees there, and you can get to this chest, so. Yeah, I know that's cheating, but I just wanted you to see exactly how I was getting through there, even though it looked like I shouldn't have been able to do that. So, there you are. Yeah, this game does a lot of bastard tricks like that. Whoa! There, you see, I can one-shot the guys when I get a critical hit, that is. Ooh, there's a magic rock over there. We want to get that. Now, this area, there's a lot of Rakshasis around here, so I want to uh, watch out for them because they might confuse me. Well, there we go. Ha! What are those things anyway? Those crystal guys? Eh, whatever. Just pin them against the wall. Stop taunting me! Stop taunting me with your battle cry! Shut up and touch the monkey! There we go. Got him. It's just like my cats when they're watching birds outside and the birds, they know that my cats can't get them, but the, the birds understand the glass, you know, but the cats, they don't understand why they can't get the birds, you know, they're, they're just out there, you know, chirping or whatever birds do, and they're just taunting them. Oh crap, I don't want to use one of my wind pins. If I can figure out what direction these guys are going, there we go. Okay, there we go. Okay, there we go. Pressing right is allowing me to go up now. See, the confusion went away. I, I knew I was close enough to the next screen, so I figured, why bother? Did I get that Magic Rock down there? Eh, whatever. But yeah, that was Magic Rock number... Which one was it? Well, I better pay attention to what's going on on the screen there instead of my other computer with my notes. There we go. Yeah, that was Magic Rock number 30 back there that I think I got. And this would be number 31. There we go die. And, okay, so that's 31 Magirax that we got so far, but that's all we can do on this path, so let's uh, backtrack to that other screen there, and yeah, I'll probably just take care of all those guys off screen again. Whoa! Ah, screw it! Get back up there! And I'm gonna do this off screen. Most of that decrease in life there, viewers, was from that one Rakshasi that confused me. I just had to go off screen. I wasn't, I'm not gonna waste a wind pin when I'm that close to, you know, getting to another segment of the screen or, or another area. Ha! You are no match for me! I think there's a weapon later in the game that's effective against wolves specifically, like a creature type that's kind of weird for an adventure game like this, but oh, there you go or an action RPG, or whatever you would call this. Huh, there's a chest over there. I bet it has something nice in there, but we can't quite reach it. Hmm. Let's see, anything interesting over here? No, no, not really. Well, let's check out this cave that we got here. Whoa, it's just a slide right into a hard ice wall. Well, that's not so bad. What's with all that shaking? Find out next time on Let's Play Terranigma! Whoa! This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day! No! And he dies.